Hey learners, Pranshi Verma this side. Welcome to my channel guys. In today's YouTube session, we are going to learn Renewable Energy Resources Unit 4 Multiple Choice Question and Answer and your Unit 4 name is Thermoelectrical and ther Thermionic Conversions. Okay, in this your first question is Thermocouple is a blank space. Option A. Territory Transducer. Option B. Secondary Transducer. Option C. Primary transducer. Option D. None of the above. Right answer is option C. Primary transducer. Okay. So, thermocouple is a primary transducer. Next question. Operation of thermocouple is based on option A. Peltier effect. Option B. CB effect. Option C. Thomson effect. Option D. All of the mentioned. Right answer is option D. All of the mention. Okay, so operation of thermocouple is based on Peltier effect as well as Seedback effect and Thomson effects also. Okay, next question. Blank space describe current flow between two junctions formed by two different metals. Option A. Peltier effect. Option B. Thomson effect. Option C. Seedback effect. Option D, none of the mentioned. Right answer is option A. Patlier effect describes current flow between two junctions formed by two different metals. Okay. Next question. In closed circuit, if the circuit type flows through a resistance R, the heat generated by the resistance is equal to I key power 2 means I square multiply by R, it is known as blank space. Option A, Patlier effect. Option B, Thomson effect. Option C, Seebeck effect. Option D, Joule effect. Right answer is option D, Joule effect. Okay. Next question. Amount of heat liberated or absorbed when 1A current, 1A means 1 ampere current passes is called option A. Petlier coefficient, option B, Thomson coefficient, option C, CB coefficient, option D, Joule coefficient. And right answer is option A, Petlier coefficient. Amount of heat liberated or absorbed when 1 ampere current passes is called Patlier coefficient. Okay. Next question. Total Seebeck effect can be found as blank space. Option A. Total Patlier effect. Option B. Total Thomson effect. Option C. Partly Patlier and Thomson effect. Option D. None of the mentioned. Right answer is option C. Partly Patlier and Thomson effect. Total seed bag effect can be found as with the help of partly Patlier and Thomson and partly Thomson effect. Okay. Next question. Patlier effect is reverse of seed bag effect. Is true or false? Is true. Next question. Which semiconductor is are used in thermoelectric power generation? Option A. Bismuth, telluride means Bi2Te3. Option B. Lead telluride, PBTE. Option C. Calcium sulfide, CES. And option D, all of the above. Right answer is option D, all of the above. Okay, so... They all are semiconductors used in thermoelectric power generation. Okay. Next question. The process of emission of electron from the hot metal surfaces is called Option A. Plastic emission. Option B. Thermionic. Thermionic emission. Option C. Static emission. Option D. Current emission. Right answer is Option B. Thermionic emission. Okay. Next question. Particles emitted from hot cath hot cathode surface. Option A. Neutrons. Option B. Electrons. Option C. Protons. Option D. None of the above. Right answer is option B. Electrons. Okay. The particle emitted from hot cathode surfaces are electrons. Okay. Next question. 
at room temperature the electron cannot escape metal surface due to option a attractive forces of nucleus option b repulsive forces of electrons option c repulsive forces of nucleus option d pulling forces of protons right answer is option a attractive forces of nucleus okay at room temperature the electron cannot escape metal surface due to attractive forces of nucleus next caption what causes wind option a rotation of the earth option b the sun heating the atmosphere option c variation in the earth surface option d all of the above right answer is option d all of the above okay rotation what cause wind so the causes are wind first one rotation of the earth second one the sun heating the atmosphere and third one is variation in the earth surface next question what is the earliest recorded use for windmills option a generating electricity option b pumping water option c dry string option d grinding grain right answer is option b pumping water next question how many blades does a modern wind turbine have option a 3 option b 4 option c 2 option d there is no standard number of blades right answer is option a 3 okay so three blades does a modern wind turbine okay next question which of these is not a part of a modern wind turbine option a gearbox option b yard drive option c compressor option d nakeel right answer is option c compressor compressor is not a part of modern wind turbine okay next question which nation leads the world in installed wind energy capacity option a china option b germany option c netherlands option d us right answer is option a china china leads the world in installed wind energy capacity next question what does heating and cooling of the atmosphere generates option a conduction currents option b convection currents option c radiation currents option d thermoline circulation right answer is option b convection currents okay next question what is the main source for the formation of wind option a uneven land option b vegetation option c seasons option d sun right answer is option d sun okay sun is the main source for the formation of wind next question Which country created windmills? Option A, US. Option B, Egypt. Option C, Mongolia. Option D, Iran. Right answer is option D, Iran. Okay. Next question. A statement: During the day, the air above the land heats up more quickly than the air above over water. Is true or false? Is true. Okay. Next question. What type of energy is wind energy? Option A renewable energy. Option B non-renewable energy. Option C conventional energy. Option D commercial energy. Right answer is option A renewable energy. Okay, renewable energy is the type of wind energy. Next question. What are used to turn wind energy into electrical energy? Option A turbine. option b generators option c blades option d yeah motors right answer is option a turbine okay turbines are used to turn wind energy into electrical energy next question diameter of wind turbines blades option a 320 feet option b 220 feet option c 80 feet option d 500 feet right answer is option b 220 feet okay so diameter of wind turbines blades are 220 feet okay next question suitable so speed to operate wind turbines option a 5 to 25 meter per second 
ऑप्शन बी टेन टू थर्टी फाइव मीटर पर सेकेंड ऑप्शन सी ट्वेंटी टू फोर्टी फाइव मीटर पर सेकेंड एंड ऑप्शन डी थर्टी टू फिफ्टी फाइव मीटर पर सेकेंड एंड राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए फाइव टू ट्वेंटी फाइव मीटर पर सेकेंड ओके नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ विंड इज ऑप्शन ए ग्लोबल विंड ऑप्शन बी लोकल विंड ऑप्शन सी बोथ ए एंड बी एंड ऑप्शन डी नन ऑफ दीज राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी बोथ ए एंड बी ओके सो क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ विंड आर ग्लोबल विंड एंड लोकल विंड ओके नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन ग्लोबल कोल्ड बाइंड मूव फ्रॉम ऑप्शन ए इक्वरियल ऑफ पोलर रीजन ऑप्शन बी पोलर टू इक्वरियल रीजन ऑप्शन सी इक्वरियल टू ओशियन रीजन ऑप्शन डी ओशियन टू इक्वरियल रीजन एंड राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी polar to equatorial region okay next question blank space force is responsible for forcing the global winds towards western direction option a coriolis is coriolis option b centripetal option c centrifugal option d gravitational right answer is option a coriolis okay coriolis force is responsible for forcing the global winds toward western direction okay next question uneven heating occurs on land surface and water bodies are due to blank space option a air currents option b solar radiation option c lunar eclipse option d none of these right answer is option b solar radiation uneven heating occurs on land surface and water bodies are due to solar radiation next question factor affecting the distribution of wind energy option a mountain chains option b the hills trees and buildings option c frictional effects of the surface option d all of the above and right answer here is option d all of the above okay factor affecting the distribution of wind energy mountain chains the hills trees and buildings and frictional effect of the surface okay next question the wind intensity can be described by option a reynolds number option b mac number option c bureau fort number option d fort number right answer is option c bureau fort number okay guys a wind intensity can be described by bureau fort number okay now let's wind up this lecture guys see you in the next video thanks for watching this video wish you very very all the best for your examination